Alexa and I'm gonna show you how to make vegan marshmallow fluff that is just amazingly delicious and it's almost like magic because this is the main ingredient <laughs> like what <laughs> and let me just show you all the other stuff that you need so yeah you have the chickpeas we're actually not using the chickpeas we're using the water that is in here and we use some vanilla flavor and a little bit of lemon juice obviously it's best to use just fresh lemons but I don't have them and that is to thicken it up but I also use gur gum tiny tiny bit or this is facilium husk um, I haven't tried to only use this and not this um, lemon juice but maybe it works but I, I think this gives it a really good taste actually and I'm not even that crazy about <laughs> lemon juice and of course we have sugar not sure exactly how much I'm gonna use but I'm starting with half a deciliter which I think is 100 grams no uh, 50 grams <laughs> and I'm just going to crush it in here so it gets a little bit more powdery and we need a strainer for the chickpeas and this whisking thing <laughs> first thing you do is to take the chickpeas and drain them into the bowl that you are using to whisk it in <laughs> just make sure you get everything and we'll put it on here and let's just watch the magic <laughs> see it's turned into white fluffy stuff and all the other ingredients are just gonna make it more fluffy and tasty <laughs> But we need some more sugar, maybe, or vanilla, or just lemon juice. I think maybe lemon juice, or all of them. <laughs> all right, I did not add any more sugar. I just added the rest of this, which also has stevia in it, as you can probably see somewhere. Doesn't it say stevia on it? Liquid stevia. Uh, anyway, and I added this. This, I'm realizing now, is really important for the taste so i think maybe i added like a teaspoon or something uh all together and now we're gonna add a little bit of this gur gum and it's important to add it a little bit just a little tiny bit and we'll turn it on and add it a little, like a little bit at a time or else it will get clumpy too much gur gum it's gonna taste like a little like rubber or something which is not so good but that is really good could add a little bit more gur gum probably but not necessarily uh, it's really really good so there it is in the light this stuff is so stiff <laughs> it's like uh, egg whites you know that you can put upside down, no worries and let's 
taste. <laughs> Choking on <laughs> marshmallow fluff. It's so good. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Um, just try it. Like seriously, it's so easy and fairly simple ingredients. I don't know if everyone has gorgam laying around, but you don't need really need it. It's definitely not just to try the recipe anyways <laughs> please give it a try and um, tell me what you think give me a thumbs up if you think this is a crazy idea <laughs> and crazy recipe um, thank you for watching see you next time bye